Oh shit. Oh no! Have mercy on my soul! <laughs> Infinite stats, way to go. Alrighty. Well, there you go. There's an example of how quickly you would die. Oh god, I died through infinite stats? You gotta be kidding me. Well, okay. Hello everyone, welcome back. My name is GGFest. How y'all doing today? Thanks for destroying Ox Evolve. We're in a new patch, and today we're going to take a look at Hard Ascendant of the Cave, the tech cave in the volcano. Now, this is just going to be showing you guys how it is on foot because I want to do a non talking and, you know, look at the whole entire cave. And this is the one I wanted to show you exactly on that. And I also wanted to show you. Um, an example of maybe you can just skip the easy and medium and go straight to hard i have not done this yet so this is going to be the first time i've done this but to get into the hard the alpha cave you need to be a level 100 requirement which i am not so i will need to make myself level 100 you also are going to need the alpha broom of the trophy the alpha mesopithecus trophy the alpha dragon trophy and then you're going to need some new things that have been added you're going to need some alpha uh, raptor claws alpha carnal arms alpha t-rex tooth alpha megalodon fin Alpha Mosasaur Tooth, Alpha Squid Eye, and Alpha Lead Blubber. Now, we know that there is an Alpha Raptor, Carno, and Rex. I don't know about the Megalodon because this is brand new, so I don't know if there's an Alpha Megalodon now. I know there's an Alpha Mosasaur. I knew there was an Alpha Squid, but I didn't know it was added quite yet. It's been in the files, but doesn't have any motion or anything, or it's not programmed to do anything. And the Alpha Lead was added last patch. So that's a, also a rare thing that you need to kill. Now, obviously, this is going to be a very hard grind. Um, what you need for the medium one, the beta, is quite literally just the uh, Raptor Claws, Carno Arms, and Rex Tooth. So I've already done the video on easy. You can go check that out in the top right right here with the little card. That's the 4K video. This will probably be also in 4K and stuff. So let me just quickly give myself a level 100, and then we're going to start this ascendant and we're going to do it all in tech here because the reason why is you have full set with ele uh, element increasingly hypothermal insulation you're going to need this for this cave you're going to need to bring some water you're going to need to bring at least i would say pro roughly about maybe five or six extra tech gear and you can bring up the 50 dinos i'm just doing this on foot to just show you exactly what spawns in the cave and how difficult it is going to be i am also on my single player so my difficulty is set to one whatever your server's difficulty is this cave will scale up to that difficulty so remember that if you're on a very high level difficulty of a server then there's going to be hell in this cave for dino spawns so let's get started and let's see how terrible this is going to be <laughs> All right, shall we begin, ladies and gentlemen? Let's see how hard hard is. Eh. Now let me turn up the volume for you guys a little bit. The music's amazing down here. Love this music. So, Dave, uh, door will close. Uh, Tames which will enter will not be coming back and you have one out of ten and fifty tames can come in here Obviously, this is literally the end game. So let's see how hard this will be You cannot fly with your tech tier, but you can use the rest of the tech tier like punching and running forward and everything So you're not limited on that But you are limited on not being able to grapple hook and you're not being uh, limited on being able to fly Which is kind of a pain, but hey, it is what it is all right. Some, nothing yet. Cave looks amazing, though. God, I love this cave. This cave is awesome. Okay, so as of right now, we got Rex's, Aloe's, and some Atherpleurus. That's a lot of creatures. That's a lot of creatures. Oh my god, look at all of them. Oh wait, what the hell is that? Is that a Giga? Oh, that is a Giga. Ha! That is a Giga.
see if I can get their attention. There we go. Yeah, they want me now. Level 42. And I didn't really shoot them that much, and they're already dying. Oh my god, Anthropores. Looks like we got Capros as well. Terror Birds. Got everything down there. Literally everything. If you can think of a dino, they there's it's down there. Let's see how well the tech grenades are gonna go for. I don't really use them much. Well, here's your first bet. What's gonna happen? If you also have dinos, then this is obviously a good idea to go down there with dinos instead. Not doing what I'm doing. Just jumping down here. That's scary. Even though I have God Mode on, or infinite stats, it's still scary as freaking hell. This looks like Tech Grenades. Oh no, Tech Grenades do pretty good. Pretty sure. Rockets, Rocket Launcher, and uh, lots of patience is gonna take your way. You have an hour to get through it, so you might as well take your time, right? One thing I wish, though, I wish I could throw and fly around. All right, stick your nades up the wazoo. Boom! All right. All right, we're doing pretty good. Yep, tech, tech rifle will be a thing to do. Come down here, by the way, with. Alright. So we have all of that. Oh, good lord. Is that Trodons? Oh, shit. Uh oh. Oh, shit. Oh, no! Have mercy on my soul! Infinite stats, way to go. Alrighty. Well, there you go. There's an example of how quickly you would die. Oh, God, I died through infinite stats? You gotta be kidding me. Well, okay. That's who killed me, is a fucking Dermetrodon. Oh yeah, the Metrodons are gonna kill everyone. That's what's gonna kill everyone. Yep, that's definitely what's gonna kill people. Yep, that's I hands down gonna say that's what's gonna kill most people. It's the Demetrodons in this cave. Dimorphs, Demetrodons, whatever the freaking hell their name, because you know I say Oh, look at the poor sleepy. <laughs> Dead. That and the Prolovias. Oh man, Prolovias. Prolovias gonna be killer in this. Alright, let's see how close I can get without them aggroing me. Oh no. Oh, there's a lot of shit. Hold on. Oh my god, this cave is gonna be so much fun. Obviously, oh my god. Dimorphodons, what the freaking hell? What's wrong with you fools? Man, you guys are crazy. Alright. 
Whatever floats your boat. Lots of Carnos. Holy shit, Carnos galore. don't have to do that. <laughs> yeah, tech grenades are going to be a way to go too, by the way, in this game. Definitely going to be a thing. Tech grenades, rocket launchers, and a lot of fucking dinos. My suggestion is going to be probably some Rexes, maybe an aloe pack, and and some other stuff as well. And Alopac's gonna be pretty good too. I wonder if you could fit a Giga in here though. That'd be kind of cool. I got multiple rocket launchers. Oh man, scissor hands though. Oh man, the scissor hands. Oh god, they're so difficult. Oh god! There's just so much shit. Where's the Giga at? I want to know where that Giga is at. Rockets away! Oh, there's another aloe. I saw a Giga in here. Where is that? Wow, there's just, there's just di Wow, wow, wow! Look at all the dinos in here. Oh my God, there's so many dinos. Oh shit! Oh God! Oh, rip! Yeah. So, this is a hard difficulty for you guys, and this is pretty crazy if you ask me. This is gonna be such a challenge for a lot of people. They're like killing each other right now, actually. Which is kind of funny. Oh, he's sleepy. Microraptors and Dylos? Really? I think he's just troll as he is. Fucks if you had those. Come on. Alrighty. I think we're good on fighting stuff now. Let's take a look at the rest of the shit. So, where is the Giga? So, the Giga is right there. Now, probably what a good strat would probably be doing if I was actually doing this survival wise is probably I would do something like this clear out this entire area over here and just shoot the fucking thing down the hole into the lava or if you can't even hit it or if arc devs you know uh Screw up the spawn of it. It cannot uh, just spawn in the wall like it has. Oh man, but these darn oh, these guys are fucking annoying though. These fucker, these flying around. So 
So yeah, Giga is uh, a little bit stuck. Because what you can do is you can just do this. And fight the Giga if you wanted to do on your foot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this um, this game's pretty hard. Let's go to the rest. I want to see what the rest of it is. I don't want to hold you guys back anymore. So obviously there's a Giga in that part section right there. Um, there's Perlovia. There's a lot of Perlovias and there's a lot of Sleepies. There's also a lot of. There's basically everything you can think of that you hate about this game. It's basically in this game, like the the Morphodon and shit. There is just so much of them. Now, obviously, like I said in the beginning, the difficulty of your server will have the difficulty of the creatures themselves. So, what I'm seeing, though, is a lot of lava areas. So, there's going to probably be a lot of dinosaurs that just run off the cliff and go into the lava. That's probably going to be another um, thing that you're going to want to worry about. Uh, but for the most part, there is just mostly carnivores and annoying-ass craps dinos. Is there any more, any other gigas or anything? Is there just one giga that spawns in? There's lots of Rexes. It looks like lots of Alice. There's another Giga. So there is a, there is two Gigas as as a moment as I can see uh, in here. Okay. That's a little bit of a concern. All right, let's see. I'm gonna skip all the credits for you guys because there's no point of seeing them or anything. But a after you activate this, you gotta wait one minute. Your dinosaurs that you have here are will be killed. The survivors that are here will also be killed. Your items in here will also be killed. So whatever you bring in here, make sure you don't really care that you're gonna lose it, and because you're gonna lose everything that you have in here. Now, this is different from the last time we did this. This is all red and everything now, which is just uh, signifying that you are, you have completed the tech cave on hard. Now, this is a placeholder, by the way. A lot of people were confused in the last video. This is a placeholder. This whole thing right here. Um, what's going to happen, my theory, is that the final boss fight, will you'll be teleported there. <clears throat> and you'll be doing the final boss fight, which is the... Um, boss that we've been talking about during the Tev Kit videos, which I can probably link on the top right or maybe in the video that we've definitely We've talked about it a lot. So let me I'm gonna just skip around. I just want to make sure it's this uh, final I'll show you this stuff and that's basically it and I'll skip all the credits from you guys It's pretty cool though music and everything's really sweet This might be saying though after you defeat the final boss because that would be pretty cool. Now I'm going to skip all this and show you what happens at the end. Alrighty, so, <clears throat> after you completely killed yourself and completed the challenge of completing hard and getting to the end game at the moment, you have now earned yourself to get uh, another five levels. Now, I'm wondering if, and also, by the way, a lot of people thought that you lost your bases and everything. No, you don't lose anything. You just can't respawn at your own beds and stuff. Um, but, you know, you lose your inventory and stuff. Alright. So, for the moment, we're just going to make sure nothing attacks us so we can go over real quickly. So, if we look in our anagrams now, we can get up to 105. Um, here is, we are now implant plus 15. Survival level max level is 15. Very interesting. So, that means, does that mean we don't even have to do easy? Let me do that real quick. Let me see if I can give myself full on XP to see what my max level is at the moment now. So let's see. So that is very interesting right there, ladies and gentlemen, that you don't even have to complete the easy or medium. You can just go straight to hard and you'll get all 15 levels. Um, but I probably would recommend doing easy to see what is happening. 
with that. Um, and I wonder if your implants can update as well when you be able to do the Manticore on Scorch Earth and any other DL DLCs. Because it looks like there's a lot more room for text-wise that they'll be able to implement and stuff. So every time you defeat, you know, the, even the Manticore, maybe you get one or two levels uh, up to three, maybe, for that as well. So yeah, but anyways, that's it. That's how you, have, that's how you do the hard um, Ascendant for the uh tech cave and stuff um obviously it's still a work in progress but it looks pretty cool so if you guys like the video leave a thumbs up a like share comment and hopefully you, that clears up some more information on what happened on the last episode because i obviously didn't explain anything because i wanted to just show you everything about it so anyways that's it hopefully everyone enjoyed i'll see you on the next one take care everyone have a good one